My guy friends are making my boyfriend insecure because they've also had a piece of my cake. Now I'm worried he'll break up with me. So I have three guy friends. They're not my only friends, but we were pretty close. I'm not gonna lie. I've been intimate with all of them multiple times and even on some occasions been with them all at once. This was when we were a lot younger and had stopped some years ago. In fact, two of them are in long-term relationships with two of my best friends and they are aware of our history. Now, my boyfriend and I have been together for about a year and it's been the best relationship I've ever had. We instantly clicked, and I know this man is endgame material. The thing is my boyfriend is a bit insecure because I'm his first lady. He's also aware of my history with my friends. I've assured him that this is in the past, and I have no attraction to them at all now, and that he's all I need. I actually ask my friends to never talk about this ever. Because, well, it's respectful, right? However, the other night, we were all hanging out, and I headed out with a friend to get some stuff. When we get back, my boyfriend's mood is much different. He plays it off, but I can tell something was bothering him. When we get back to my place, I press the issue, and he says my guy friends kept making Eskimo brother jokes and how he got the leftovers, and told them about how good he must be if he can satisfy me the same way all of them couldn't. I was furious and confronted my friends. They kept saying they were trying to man up my boyfriend since I told them he felt insecure about them. My boyfriend kept trying to save face, saying things that the past is the past, but I can tell he's feeling down. I decided to cut off my friends because not only they disrespected my boyfriend, but also me by calling me leftovers. My two best friends keep saying that it's not a big deal and that me and my boyfriend are overreacting. Do you think I am? Also, how can I make this up to my boyfriend? I try to show him how, but he hasn't been in the mood. I feel really bad and know I need to work some magic to ensure he never leaves me. Update. It's been a long couple days, and my boyfriend has finally opened up. He said he's glad I cut off my friends and that he wasn't going to ask me to do it, but if I hadn't, he would have left. He said he doesn't want to break up over this, as it wasn't something wrong I did. He gets that most people have a past and that I didn't even know him back then. It just became too real when my ex-friends opened their mouth. He's also mad at me because I told him his insecurities, something that I know was a horrible mistake. I apologized profusely and promised this was never gonna happen again. He also says he feels inadequate and inferior. He said how the hell am I supposed to compare? I'm just one guy. I assured him that he's way better than them and that he's all I want from now on. We kept talking for a while eventually. We hugged it out. He says he doesn't feel ready to wrestle again and asked me to respect that, which I agreed to. He also says he doesn't want to hang out with any other former partner. He says he won't freak out of anything if we run into one at like a party or something, but he won't hang out with them which is more than fair after what happened. One of my best friends reached out and apologized for what she said. She thought my former friends just mentioned our history and my boyfriend got all insecure, but didn't realize just how horrible they were. She said she broke up with him already. I haven't heard from the other friend. As for me, I feel absolutely disgusting knowing I let those guys touch me. And I know I effed up when I told them about my man's insecurity. I take full responsibility for disclosing my boyfriend's insecurities. I effed up by calling the wrong people my friends. Update. It's been a few of weeks since the whole incident happened. While a lot of you are horrible in the comments, I appreciate the few of you who were more supportive. My boyfriend and I seem to be back on track now. He's back to his old self and has been very loving and sweet. I've been as affectionate as possible without being too intimate. I've been making him meals, got him a couple of gifts, and complimented him. We had a deep talk about boundaries and we talked out what happened. He forgave me for talking about his insecurities to my friends, and I promised him that I won't ever do anything like that again. We also talked about his insecurities, by the way. He's fully aware of my previous posts and say it's fine because no one knows who we are. Well, after I assured him he's the best I've had, which is true, and that I don't want anyone else but him, well, he got his confidence back and he wasn't shy to show me. So things are good now with us. I've learned my mistake. As for my former friends, I've blocked them on everything and I have no desire to ever see them again. 
While I don't expect my relationship to never have problems again, I think we've moved on from this now.